I'm not playing with these cicadas. So, oh, we should have asked for faith. We got Little Caesars tonight. Isaiah had a game. I had a bomb. I had a home run. <laughs> and uh, anyway, we have the Italian cheese bread. And the butter garlic sauce. I love the butter garlic sauce. Cheese pizza. A pepperoni pizza. And a meat lover's pizza. We had only ordered two, but um, they gave us the wrong one. And of course, instead of taking it back, the wrong one back, they gave us what we needed. So we ended up with three pizzas instead of two. So you guys, it is at night. Jalen called me, but the <laughs> cicadas is out pretty bad. She's been out with her friends. It's nighttime. She wants me to open the door. Okay, y'all watch this. <laughs> watch her come flying in here. <laughs> Hey guys, so I am eating this Asian chopped salad kit for lunch. I had gotten these oh a long time ago. Me and my husband used to eat these sometimes. And then my sister-in-law reminded me about it. She sent it to me. She had found had found it. And I was like, oh yeah, I used to eat that too, you know. So I bought one the other day at Aldi's. Got me one and the Asian one. I love this one. I haven't tried another one, I don't think. Other than the Asian, I can't remember, but I know I love the Asian, so I got it. And that's what I'm eating right now. Y'all, <laughs> I just ate cereal out of this bowl, but I rinsed it out. And um, I had some rice checks. I'm eating a late breakfast. So I had some rice checks. The cereal don't hold me long at all. So then after the rice checks, I cleaned out my bowl. And I got this Asian chopped salad in it. So cause I usually eat out of a salad bowl, but y'all eating out my cereal bowl. It's very delicious. <laughs> she made it safely in. Boy, it's, it has just rained recently and the when it rains, the cicadas stay to the trees or either they're kind of smashed to the ground, their wings are wet. But otherwise, oh, they'd be flying everywhere. So she got, she got lucky that time. She was blessed that time. The cicadas didn't get her cause they wings was wet. And they she know I'm taping her. <laughs> hey guys, so it is after 11 uh, p.m. It's Friday night. And I thought I'd just come on and chit chat with you all. I rarely come on and just chit chat. But um, I, well, as you all saw, Jalen, she went out with some friends. So I'm here, you know, I've been alone for the past couple of hours. Isaiah and Chris, they went out for a while um, looking for some stuff for their GoPro. So anyway, I've been here a while tonight and just getting back into my paperwork and different things, getting organized. Um, Jalen, she went out with some friends uh, to a graduation party. So she, as y'all know, is back at home and everything. She started work Monday, so she's so excited about that. We're so excited for her. And um, anyway, she has been, you know, just re reacclimating herself with her friends from like high school and different things um you know you all know she had a squad and they are all have all been in school i think a few of them have one more year to go in college and uh, some of them have graduated along with her this year so um she's going to graduation parties and everything so tonight there's a graduation party so she went to one of her friends' graduation parties with some of her other girlfriends. So she's just enjoying herself. And as y'all saw 
that she was ducking the cicadas. We are under a cicada invasion attack, whatever you want to call it. Y'all, the cicadas is out. And we got a big tree in our front yard. And the cicadas are just ooh, all in it. And I don't even want to go outside. Um, I had to go out. I ushered at a funeral on Wednesday at my church. They weren't too bad over there. So I didn't didn't run into any when I was at church. I went to Aldi's after and it was raining after I got, you know, out of the funeral and got into Aldi. So that keeps them down. The rain keeps them down because their wings, I guess, get real heavy. They can't fly in the rain or whatever. But they were not out at that time. So I have escaped them. I'm just hoping that I can. Because people have been saying they've been flying and their face hitting up against them. You know, and all that stuff. And I'm just like, oh. They have been flying into our windows and stuff like that. They're just icky. And they're big, thick, and just some ugly little creatures. But um, anyway, I have not been going out too much. Uh, I did a click list. Because I have been going you know, Krogering and Audiing myself. I've done the click list many times before, but I just got out of the practice of it. And I've been going Kroger's, you know, all these grocery shopping myself. But when these cicadas came back, I made a Kroger's click list. And I did that, uh, I think that was Monday I did that, and had just the worst experience. I don't know if they don't train these kids right. Have any of you all had that problem, like if you use the click list or the Walmart grocery shopping, you know, service or whatever, the kids just seem like, and then when I'm walking through Kroger's shopping myself, I see them on their phones. When they're shopping for other people, they're supposed to be doing the click list for other people. They be on their phones and doing this, doing that, and they just look so nonchalant at work. It just gets on my <laughs> but um yes yeah, so i had a bad experience with that so i did let kroger know that i was not happy with my shopping experience they put the well the little, little fella he put my groceries in my trunk and some of them weren't even in the bag we're not even in the bag um they were supposedly out of eight items i have never not found more than i might have gone before and maybe two items were not in stock or something like that but one or two items but eight i'm like they got lazy or whatever and just didn't want to find the items or either was on their phone and ran out of time by the time my order was due to be delivered out to my car some i just do not believe that they couldn't find eight items and they weren't anything out of the ordinary either so i was not happy about that Anyway, back to what I'm doing now after my little rant. Um, I'm doing my planner. I'm back to doing my planner. So I am happy to be getting back organized, getting my um, financial papers in order, um, just making sure. Oh, and I got my apps, my um, bank apps on my phone so I could check that every day, my balances every day, any uh, transactions or activity. Because somebody close to me... Some money got stolen out of their account the bank replaced it but yeah somebody committed fraud you know online did something and got some money from them and oh my goodness I'm like let me keep track of this more often than I do so I got all my bank apps on my phone so I can check them um, so and just getting back to what I need to be doing daily because before when we were doing the house I could not, I couldn't even, I didn't even have time to write in my planner to say what I needed to do the next day or the next week or whatever. So I am feeling so much better. We are at the end of the home decorating. We've got two more rooms to show. Um, I feel less stressed because we are at the end. I do have the back room to clean up after we get done doing the two rooms. The back room where the pool table is and then in the basement basement we just have a lot of stuff that you know from before we redecorated everything is just in those rooms and it's like stuff that you some stuff is like you can't throw away but you don't want to put into the new rooms either <laughs> so we got to figure out what to do with that stuff we got to throw away or go to goodwill or store it in the um, cabinets in the basement so we'll see Anyway, I am on to July planning and I am, so, well, June, the rest of June. I'm planning the rest of June and July. 
and yeah so i'll go over i may do another planner video coming up soon um and this is my planner i love my planner it is a binder home management well not home management i have one of those and they are thick this is my personal planner binder and as most of you all know i just couldn't do the regular binder that you buy or the regular planner that you buy and I had to just make one myself that suits my needs so I just printed off calendars from um, online and just made my own planner binder I've been doing this for years you know making my own so yeah it just has everything in it that I need I could des design it the way I wanted to so got that done tomorrow we have two games Isaiah has two baseball games in the morning uh, 10 o'clock and 12 o'clock and then hopefully I'll be able to get my two DIYs done for the dining room so I can get that dining room you know redecorating video out so that is it I will see you guys next time I don't know if I'll come back or if this will be the end of the video but I got to get back to planning so Jalen's home now. She wants me to open the door for her. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, hopefully she don't have her heels on. Uh oh. Yeah, she do. She got her heels on. <laughs> is fenced off now and the old high school is about to be torn down there's the new one right next to it we're gonna tear this one down do you know what they're putting in here parking lot oh okay this is gonna be the parking lot wow 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 mm -hmm. here we go once again It's Saturday, and she has gone to another graduation party. And here she goes. Oh, oh my goodness. She is. ground turkey, smoked sausage, corn, cilantro, green onion, regular onion, red onion, tomatoes, um, corn, sour cream, ranch sauce, taco sauce, cheese, all that good stuff. Family style served on one platter. I wash our hands after the game and I came home and made some chocolate chip cookies, just five. I have a recipe that you can make just five cookies with. And I put in, instead of vanilla and almond flavor, I put in vanilla butternut flavor. And it has a yellow tint to it. So the cookies are a little bit more yellowish this time, but that is okay. I'm very excited because I changed the recipe a little bit. So I'm excited to see what they taste like. Hey, paparazzi. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So we enter into the showstopper. <laughs> no, but this is Jalen's room so far. She is redoing it a little bit. And this is her bed area. That was that's the same. Um but she has a new monitor and everything. She set up for work. Mm -hmm. and let's get the desk area together and I probably should have filmed when you got it all finished huh what you mean with your mat and everything that you put in there or your new chair oh, yeah. a little stuff back there chair. yeah well I'll come back when you do that but this is the progress so far she's making it her own space and she's working now working from home and they're so nice. Mm -hmm. Show them my light show. 
So she has a shadow box. Has her graduation gown in there. They gave a mask to wear on graduation day. So that's that. And her cord. One of the cords. You had how many cords? Oh. Several cords there. And then her magna cum laude. Magnum cum laude. <laughs> a medallion. Switching it over from her high school year. Don't roll. Trying. Mm -hmm. Trying. <laughs>